Hello Zwifters, welcome to this episode of How to Run on Zwift. Today we're looking at the uh, February 2019 update to the game. It's not a massive update, it's only been released today. There are no new courses or anything like that, no new levels, so nothing huge. But what it is, is a tantalising glimpse of what's to come. So let's delve in and have a little look at what's going on. The first thing to notice is if I get my finger right, there. That icon has changed. It used to have a little prize, a little kind of parcel at the end there. That parcel is gone and it's a slight change indicating something is going on with levels. So the next thing to do is make myself small and let's just nip over to the menu here. And look, the customization screen has changed. So all the items that you can use to customize your avatar are on the left here with your man on the right. Slightly different from what it used to be, but it gets more interesting. Let's go and have a look at socks. So click on socks and look, it seems like we've got a normal selection, but if we move down, oh, 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 level 28, level 36 locked. What does that mean? Well, obviously what it means is that imminently there are new levels on the way, at least up to 36. Let's see what else we've got. Glasses. Ah, you're up to level, level 47. Right. I bet we're going to have the same number of levels as cycling has. Cycling has 50 levels very shortly. Probably in the next update, we will get 50 levels in running. So that's it for customization. Um, something I did notice though, interestingly, look, shorts. I've got a nice long pair of shorts, but <laughs> look at that. I can make them really short. I didn't know if you could do this before, but you can now make your shorts long <laughs> or really short. Maybe you could do that before. I've just never noticed it before. So that's it for the customization screen. Um, but then we go into pair and if we click the spanner icon which takes us to the calibration tool look there's been a slight tweak to the calibration tool so now you can see at what speeds slow normal and fast will be the fastest you can calibrate is a normal speed of 16.1 a fast speed of 17.6 and the slowest you can calibrate is 4.9 kilometers an hour whether anything has been done under the hood to improve the calibration tool i don't know because i know that a lot of us feel that adding the three-point calibration tool has actually probably not helped very much and in fact in some cases made things worse. So let's hope that over time, if not now, over time the calibration tool does improve. In this update the cyclists have got something that we in running haven't yet got. So again it's another tantalizing view of what's to come for us. If we go into garage here you'll see that the cyclists now have a drop shop drops of sweat and if I click on this I can now buy cycling frames so if I go into specialized look it costs I currently have as a level 24 cyclist I currently have one million about one and a half million drops of sweat to spend so I could buy this specialized alley bike frame for 127,800 drops of sweat uh, so that's something that the cyclists have got which we haven't got yet but we in running will be getting that drop shop at some point where we will be able to buy our own running gear so if we go and have a look now at, remember I pointed out before the levels. So now we are earning drops of sweat. So level 24 I'm on for cycling. Do you know what? I've been on level 24 for about a billion years because I simply haven't used cycling for ages. Since I started running on Zwift, the cycling has gone out of the window. So um, level 24 cyclist and I have 1,556,250 drops of sweat. And as I move up the levels, I earn more drops of sweat. So the more you run, the more drops of sweat you earn, the higher up the levels you go, but the more drops of sweat you have to spend in the drop shop on running gear when that becomes available. I'm not sure I've seen this before either. Maybe this is new. You can let me know if it isn't. Um, you can change your run now. So it's either public, available to your followers only, or completely private. I haven't noticed that before. Is that new? Or is that an old feature? Anyway, there we are. 
And I think, guys, unless I've missed something, that is it for the new February 2019 update. Not a massive update, but a tantalising glimpse of things to come. Take care. We'll see you for the next one. Bye-bye.